Well, thousands of people take the GO train to work every day in Toronto, and there is a unique story emerging involving two commuters who fell in love while taking transit. Audra Brown has the story. I was taking the GO train to work, and I got off at um, Exhibition Station, and I noticed this guy, um, very handsome, of course. I had no idea. <laughs> I was totally, I was just oblivious to, uh, to everything. And then every day as I took the train to work in Liberty Village, um, I continued to see him, and I was very curious about him, but I could never say hi. I was kind of on my phone and not paying attention to a thing. Never noticed her. No, not at all. Well, Jonathan didn't know it, but for about six months, he was walking around this city with a nickname. Jen kept calling him train boy in her mind. Actually, it wasn't just in her mind. Jen was telling all of her friends and family about this guy she kept seeing on the go. And she wasn't just talking about it. She was blogging about it, too, until one day. I happened to be on LinkedIn and noticed one of my friends um, connected with this guy who I dubbed Train Boy. Well, now that she finally had a name for the man she kept seeing here on this platform, she decided she better investigate him a little more. Let's not call it stalking, but she finally did find him on Facebook and after much encouragement from her friends, decided to send him a message. It was like, holy crap, it's you. <laughs> was your first instinct to go, well, like, who is this, some kind of stalker or something? Yeah, seriously, I was, uh, I was pretty taken aback and uh, just responded, I'm sorry, I have no idea who you are. But don't worry, Jen's love train didn't get derailed there. In fact, she did finally meet up with her train boy, and now three years later. We just got engaged on Saturday, which is really exciting, on my birthday, so it was such an amazing surprise. And in fact, it seems finding love on public transit is not all that uncommon. We hear about all kinds of things that happen that way, and uh, it's very nice to hear about uh, happy endings like this. Who needs dating apps when you can uh, find, uh, find love on the go? As long as you're paying attention. Yeah, exactly. As long as you have your head up. That's, uh, that's really all that matters. Well, the two do plan to have their engagement photos taken right here at the platform where Jen first spotted her train boy. At Exhibition Grounds, Audra Brown, City News.